He's forgotten the ABC of politics. He should be addressing cost of living issues, cost of living issues, <laughs> uh, cost of living issues, and then cost of living issues. Uh, Mr. Speaker, I want to talk about a subset of those cost of living issues being one of the imposts upon New Zealanders coming up on the 1st of July, which is the increase in ACC levies that we're all facing in this country. Now, these increases were over-egged by the government last year as a consequence of their claims of a crisis at ACC, and they were telling everyone in New Zealand that ACC was fundamentally broken, that there were some significant changes that were needed there in order to justify their plans to both cut cover and privatise parts of ACC. But under the cover of that, they couldn't really go through with it without hyping the financial problems that they said that ACC had, and they talked about there being billions of dollars of extra liability, much of which was caused by the financial crisis, decreasing the rates of return on their investments. But as a consequence of their claimed problems at ACC, they had to go through with it and they had to put up everyone's ACC levies. And tomorrow, ACC levies go up for New Zealanders, and everyone who owns a car, their registration fee is going up by $30 per annum. $30 more for their ACC levy on their car. For the, le le the levy that they pay as an earner, that's going up for every $100 of their earnings. It, w it has been until now $1.70, and that's going up by to $2 uh, per $100 of earnings, an increase of closer to 20% than 10%. Very significant increases ahead of the rate of inflation. And were they needed? Were they needed? No, they were not needed because we heard from Dr Smith this last week, I think it was last week, at Select Committee that ACC miraculously is projected to have a surplus of $2 billion this year. Not next year, $2 billion surplus this year. $2 billion surplus this year, much better than the Minister would have uh, had everyone believing at the end of last year when he set these levies, and as a consequence, they have pushed the levies higher than they needed to push them. So everyone in New Zealand who owns a car, whether they're a business or a private person, their registration fee for each and every car is going up $30. And if it's a motorbike, it's even worse. If it's a motorbike, the increase for the motorbike owner is between $70 and $170 a year. And those increases would not have needed to be as high if the Minister hadn't so exaggerated his claims as to problems at ACC, because in order to justify those outrageous claims of insolvency and the other claims he was made, let's not forget he said that ACC was insolvent. He said that they were insolvent. On his measure of insolvency, ACC has never been solvent since the day it started, Mr Speaker. Because he asserted that until it had a fully funded book, uh, until it had enough um, assets on its books to pay the whole of life cost of all claims on the books, that it was insolvent. Now, he's ca claiming now that they've made enormous progress in the last year, that it's now financially stable. Those are both statements that he made, and that it's on track to make a $2 billion surplus this year. Not next year, this year. So why, Mr Speaker, why then these exaggerated increases in ACC levies, are they being foisted upon the public? Well, it's actually to make ACC unpopular. That's really what they want. They want people to think that ACC is so fundamentally expensive and broken that they can justify their plans to change it. They want people to not be concerned about ACC being privatised. They want people to put up with the decreases they want to put up with the decreases in the scope of cover that are coming through. Some of these things have, are really patently unjust, what's happening with the likes of virtually no people getting counselling approved for, for um, sexual abuse. You know, the rate of approval down, is down by more than 80 per cent in respect of approvals. Patently unfair. We've got um, decreased or increased rates of people being turned down for operations on their shoulder and things when they hurt them. We've got more costs being put on people for hearing aids. Uh, everywhere in ACC, they're getting meaner. And in addition to that, they're putting up everyone's levies. So you're paying more and you're getting less. You're paying more, you're getting less. And, it, and, and this has been because the minister exaggerated the woes at ACC.
Cheers to Boroughs.